It's caribou season. It's time for a new adventure. Here we go. there blueberries wild blueberries. wild alaska blueberry yummy low bush blueberries huh uh-huh mm. how's it taste oh my goodness there's blueberries everywhere oh my gosh not only do we find blueberries but if you look at my feet here it's cranberries and blueberries together. Is that the cranberry right there? Yeah. Oh yeah. Cranberry and blueberry patch. Blueberries everywhere. All of this ground we're on here is blueberries. All of it. Whew.
up so the trail keeps going to the ridge right there. There's normally a camp right up there. Oh. But, yeah. The idea is just get on these high spots and overlook overlook a bigger, a big area. It's pretty exciting for me since uh, this is my first caribou hunt where I'm retired and I don't have to go back. I'm pretty excited. All right, it's day two and we're at our camp. We're getting ready to take off for the day. Yesterday, uh, I did not get a caribou, but we got into several caribou. Yeah. But unfortunately, they were moving too fast for me and my skill level was not good enough. Uh, I didn't even take a shot. It wasn't worth the risk uh, of them moving too fast yeah, and getting wounded. Yeah, making an unethical shot or something, so. Yeah, but hopefully today we're gonna run She's into She's pretty some. new to this hunting thing, so I'm proud of her for getting out here and getting it done, getting with this cold, windy, wet weather and yeah. and trying to get this caribou taken care of. So super nice to be able to have Vaughn with me on this hunt. She, this is her first year of being retired so she can stay up here with me whenever, as long as she wants.
we just found the caribou. Uh, got a nice bull. He's down right over here. Let's go check it out. Oh, she's beautiful. What a beauty. Oh, yeah, look at that. Yeah, it's all rolled around. Yeah. So sweet. All right. Got some back scratchers on them. Oh yeah. All right, let's beautiful. get a side shot. What do you think of that? All right, so we got it. We got our camera bull. He's nice. Got a lot of mass. Good velvet. This is what we were after. We're excited. I wanted Vaughn to be able to get the first shot, but it just didn't work out. So. Uh, but we've got time. We got all the time in the world, and we're on the hunt for Vaughn's caribou bull. This is a lot of meat here for our freezer and we're sure we're thankful to be able to harvest this animal. It's gonna be awesome. Amazing. Good All job, right. baby. Let's get it processed. Okay. Yeah. gorgeous out here oh man i mean look at this place yeah it's beautiful the i can't believe the fog came up off us just enough to see to get this bowl i know right it's amazing let's pop that leg and flip him towards you just to get things squared up it's gonna be hard to pull I mean, this was probably the toughest caribou I've ever shot. Thanks, 
All right, well, our first caribou for season 2021 is down. Yay! Guys, this is a good hunt. This is, a, it's just fun. You know, we drove up here, we woke up. Well, first off, we're in an RV. <laughs> Last year when Ryan came up here and it rained so hard, he decided, nah. There's no reason, so. so we just drive in and out. Yeah, we got the RV. We, we decided to sleep in today. Everyone got up so early. Three in the morning, our neighbor. We got out of there at like nine o'clock drive up the hill and we're just kind of sitting around looking and then the fog cleared come up over the top up over top and the fog cleared and oh there it is there's caribou. like 30 40 caribou and two nice bulls so we ended up harvesting one and some people that were uh, kind of a yeah, ridge over right, they yeah. harvested the second one and so yeah here's paid the, off let's get vonahum yeah here's to me getting one too <laughs> yeah let's get her a big one all right More caribou to be had. More to be had.
we didn't get, or I didn't get a caribou today. Uh, we gave it a good try, and Ryan got me into quite a bit of caribou, but it just wasn't meant to happen, I guess. Nope. We got, uh, right at the end of the day, you can see the sun setting behind us. My caribou's down at camp, and we need to get that to town, get it processed. It's more important for us to have a good quality meat yep. than it is to have more meat. The season's going to be going for a while. There's a quota on the caribou up here, so... Yeah, so we're not uh, in a big hurry to get my caribou. No. But we are in a big hurry to make sure that we get our meat saved and not wasted. So yep. that's what we're going to do. We're going to beat feet out of here, and we're going to uh, take it back and get it processed. Sure enough. So it's the end of this hunt, the end of this video, but it's not the end of our caribou hunting this year. We'll be back at it with Vaughn, trying to get a caribou again, and I'm sure we'll put another video out. So guys, thanks for watching. If you like it, give us a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. We do hunts like this generally in the fall. Mm -hmm. We do some fishing during the summer and just generally living life in Alaska. But mainly what we're doing is building a house off grid in Toke, Alaska and documenting that adventure. So if you want to come along, please consider subscribing. Yep. And we will see you see on, on the, the next, next one. one. <laughs>